to Jesus, all honor to Mary. Good morning, my dear friends in Christ. We begin this Sunday reflection in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our reading for today is from the Gospel of John, chapter 1, from verse 6 to 8, and 19 to 28. We shall be considering the topic, Be a Witness to the Light. Be a Witness to the Light. The Apostle John in this passage was confronted about his identity. The people asked him who he was. Was he the Messiah, Elijah, or the prophet? We are told in the passage that John, the Apostle, confessed and spoke the truth that he is not the Christ. Who then is he? He said he is a witness to the light. He is not the light but a witness to it. Hear me again. John said he is not the light, but a witness to it. Please note that the light in the passage is not just any light. It is not the light you get from the rays of the sun or electric light. It is light with capital L. The light that John was bearing witness to is the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. Who came to show us the way to God? The light we are talking about today is our Lord Jesus Christ. Who came to show us the way to God? John prepared the way for the people in his generation to seek God. And he lived as a witness to the light of God. He lived to bear testimony to the light of God. His life was an evidence of the presence and power of God. Amen. What will your answer be if somebody should confront you with the question, Who are you? Will you say, I am honorable, doctor, chief, professor, and so on and so on. The son of praise, barrister. You can call whatever you are. If somebody looks at your work and your behavior and asks you, are you a Christian? Do you live as John who was a witness to the light? Does what you do showcase that you are the light of God? Do you showcase light of God in what in your daily living? What will be your honest answer? That is a question that God is asking us right now. John the Baptist answered that he is not the light, but is a witness to it. Jesus Christ is the light of God and the light of the world. Our work and our lifestyle should point people to the Messiah. We should live as people who show the way of salvation. We should be witnesses and testifiers of the goodness of God. Say that you are a testimony. Your life is a testimony. You live for people to see Christ in you. I pray to God to help us and make us a true witnesses to the true light of God. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The light that shines, which darkness cannot overcome. That is our prayer, that God will make us the light that shines, which darkness can never, never overcome, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Say to yourself, I am a light. I am the light of God, and I will shine. Your life will shine. Your business will shine. Anywhere you step into, you will shine. To the glory of God in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Thank you, Jesus. I wish you a lovely week, a lovely Sunday, and a fruitful week ahead. Be a light of God in your office. Be a light of God in your house. Be a light of God in anything you do. Hallelujah. Amen.